I'm your student nurse today, and I'm going to be providing you with wound care. Can you tell me your name and date of birth? Okay. No known allergies. 30 minutes ago, we gave you some pain medication. Can you t rate your pain level now from one to from zero to ten? One. Okay. It's good. I'm going to close the door to provide privacy and wash my hands. I'm going to apply some gloves. Okay, Mr. Johnson, I'm just going to lift up your gown, only exposing your um, area that I'm treating. Okay. I'm going to take off your, take out this um, HD pad off your wound. Are you doing okay, Mr. Johnson? You doing okay? that there's minimal drainage, uh, no odor. The wound bed is a deep red with uh, normal tissue healing properly, and the drainage is a serious sanguineous granular tissue. That away. And I'm going to take off these. The wound edges are not approximated. Take off these gloves in the trash and wash my hands. Next I'm going to prepare my sterile field. I'm going to, Mr. Johnson, can I put this measuring device right here for me? Thank you. Open my sterile field. Away. This side. to pour my sterile solution. I'm checking to make sure that the solution is clear without any abnormal colors and that the uh, and that it has not been expired. Okay, I'm gonna open it for the very first time. I'm gonna leave the cap up. I'm gonna pour in my solution without splashing. Next, I'm going to put on my sterile gloves. Uh -oh. Before I do that, I'm going to fix Mr. Johnson's I don't want to expose you too much. Sterile gloves. I'm touching the outside. Okay. 
Next, I'm going to clean the wound. So I'm going to take my 4x4 gauze and dampen it, moisten it in the sterile solution and wring it out. And then I'm going to wipe the wound from head to toe. Make sure not to touch the wound. Throw that away. Mr. Johnson, how are you feeling? Okay. I'm going to do another one, dampen it. Take out the excess, wipe this side, throw it in my red bag, and do it one more time. And then wipe the other side. Just throw that in my red bag. Okay, next I'm going to measure the wound. get my clean um, Q-tip, my sterile clean Q-tip and moisten it. I'm going to measure from head to toe, making sure not to touch the actual wound itself. I'm going to measure it. And the wound is about four inches in length. I'm going to measure the width, the length, the width, making sure not to touch. Okay. And then the width is about one and a half. No, maybe one and a fourth inch. And then I'm going to measure the depth. How are you doing, Mr. Johnson? Okay, good. The depth is about a half an inch. Okay, I'm going to throw that away. And next I'm going to take my gauze, open it up. And put it in my sterile solution. I'm going to get another Q-tip, sterile Q-tip, prepare that. I'm going to take my sterile gauze out. I opened it up so that it would be nice and fluffy and aerated and drain out the excess fluid. And then I'm going to pack the wound with this Q-tip, making sure not to break sterile field. And not to pack it too intense because you want to keep the wound aerated. Okay. I'm going to set that down and get another gauze. I'm going to open it up. Hold it in my hand and with my sterile Q-tip once again, continue packing. sure not to break sterile field and touch any of the edges. Okay. And now I'm going to throw that away in my red bag. I'm going to take two dry gauze. I'm going to place them on top of the wound. Making sure not to break sterile field. And I'm going to take my ABD pad and place that on top of the wound as well. How are you doing, Mr. Johnson? Okay. And I'm going to take off these sterile gloves. Throw them away. And I'm going to take the, take the wound.
are you doing, Mr. Johnson? You doing good? Two more pieces of tape. going to throw everything away. Okay. I've given you your call light and then I've lowered the head of the lowered the bed. Um, is there anything else you need, Mr. Johnson? Okay. Take these gloves off. Throw them away. And then I would document that the um, the odor there was no odor of, to the wound. How well Mr. Johnson tolerated the pain, tolerated um, the procedure. Uh, their wound edges were not approximated. There was minimal drainage, serious sanguinous, and the wound bed was dark a dark red.